Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, I almost stole somebody's dog today. I did because I want a dog, but <laughs> I'm waiting until we move because we're moving to an expensive ass place. So if you guys haven't noticed, I've been on a very strict budget. So it's not time for me to get a dog yet. So guys, I saw this little dog and he was walking and he had a collar on and he was looking up at me and he like he peed on the na I don't know he was walking through the neighborhood and he peed on the neighbor's mailbox and then he walked across the street and pooped in the other person's yard but I'm just like looking around for this dog's owner and I couldn't find anybody and I called my husband and I'm like I would be really wrong if I took this dog it had a collar but I never picked it up was I was I wrong for wanting to take that dog? Because I wanted to take that dog. Like, I wanted to get out and pick that dog up and bring it home with me. Actually, I did get off the car, but I never got close enough to it to see if it had like a little, you know how the collar has like a little charm piece on it with the address or whatever. I didn't get close enough to see if it had one of those. I don't even know what kind of dog it was, but it was a small dog and I want a small dog. And it was not the cutest but it looked like it needed a home. So I'm like, it has a collar, so it probably has an owner. But if it has an owner, why is it walking around the neighborhood like this with no owner? Like it could get hit by a car or something, like I don't know. So I was going back and forth with Adam and he told me that I better not steal anybody's dog, so I left the dog. <laughs>